Hey everyone, SDM Kahuna back again, and this is a quick follow on Battlefield Hardline video from the one I uploaded yesterday. Now, as I put in the previous video, some people, myself included, have been experiencing problems with Punk Buster causing the game to to basically lag out when rendering video. Now, basically speaking, after a little bit of trolling around, all shoutouts go to a gentleman called Fullban on the Battlefield Battlelog forums. Uh, he's been posting and he referenced a guide from a previous problem dating back to 2013 on Battlefield 3. Now what this is, there's a little config file. If you go into whatever your installed directory is, your user folder, app data, local, and you will find a punk buster folder. Now in here is another subsequent set of folders for each game that's installed. You find BFH for Battlefield Hardline and a PB folder. Now you need to create a file called pbsys.cfg. This is a config file. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to put in the description down below the settings that are in this file. It's just a text document. Just make sure you rename the extension so it works. And the most important part of what this does is it runs a default configuration for Punk Buster Scan because Punk Buster scans your memory looking for code that shouldn't be running in the background to make sure you're not cheating. Now, the default is it checks every 20 milliseconds. This changes it to 500 milliseconds. Now, the plus point of this is it reduces the, the kind of frame jitter. doesn't eliminate it completely. It's not a 100% solution because it's still... Punk Buster has to scan your system otherwise... As you saw previously from the last video, it would kick you out. But it does mitigate it, so we get much, much smoother frame output. As you can see here, it's like just running a quick game of test. Little judder here and there, but the game's playable. The you know I can actually aim, I can pan side to side without feeling like I'm I'm getting dizzy. Kind of got kind of a motion sickness kind of feel because you, you, you're you picking it up on dropping frames it's really annoying but it's a lot smoother like i say not a hundred percent as i'm getting my ass shot here but you know i can actually keep track of targets now i can see what's happening the the gameplay is much less jittery and like i say big shout out to fullban on the i'll put a post to the uh i'll put a url to the the post he's been doing in the battle log forums been a lot of good work by him and testing out and checking all this out so kudos kudos to you sir that's a lot of work that you put into this and if you guys have been experiencing this problem you can run this config like i say it will make life a little bit smoother for you it's not as you're probably going to see here make you any better at playing the game but you know i put it down to the fact i spent a lot of time trying to suss this out so i haven't actually had much time to play the game yet but again Hopefully you guys find this helpful. The description, the text, you can copy and paste it. And I'll have instructions for the install directories in the notes down below. So again, guys, hope it helps. This is SDM Kahuna, signing off.